If I asked you what's a vacuum is, what would be your response? It's like nothing. No matter. Nothing exists in a vacuum. Hey, wait a second. How can you say that vacuum exists if you define it as the known existent? A vacuum, in fact, is the situation in which a quantum system is at the minimum energy level. Uh. Okay, okay, slow down. What the hell is a quantum system supposed to be? In order to understand it, we've got to enter the quantum mechanics world, where nothing makes sense. Reality can be described through the quantum field theory, which is the sum of special relativity and quantum mechanics. What is a field? A field is an instrument through which you assign a physical quantity to every point of space, for example, temperature. Thank you. You're welcome, dear. A quantum field has a function that expresses the energy level of every point of space. The quantum field continuously oscillates, and from this oscillation's particles are continuously originated and reabsorbed. It's a different way to imagine matter compared to our everyday experience. Mass is just the excitation of a quantum field. <laughs> now, every kind of particle is associated to a different field. So we have electron field, quark fields, Higgs field, and muon fields, gluon fields. Depending on the kind of field, a certain amount of energy in a point can correspond to the presence or the absence of a particle. For example, most fields have a structure like this one. At a high energy level, a particle appears, while at the minimum energy level, there's nothing. Okay, that makes sense. We've got a vacuum in every sense. Minimum energy level and no particle. But some fields like the Higgs field have a different structure, like this one. We've got a false vacuum with no particle, but with an energy level that's not the minimum one, and a true vacuum with the presence of a particle. <laughs> Quantum mechanics is so crazy. Okay, it's all very cool, but after all, I've got a warm house, food, clothes, TV, donuts. Why should I bother about vacuum? Well, think of the Big Bang. One of the things born to explain this amazing fact is the inflationary theory. According to this theory, originally the universe was a space entirely occupied by a quantum field with this energy structure called inflaton that was in a false vacuum stages. Because of the quantum oscillations, in a certain point of space 13.8 billion years ago, the inflaton fell to the minimum energy level. And by falling, two things happened. Number one, in the falling stage, the inflaton generated repulsive gravity, expanding the space it was in enormously. Number two, once reached the minimum energy level, the inflation began to free the original energy it had in the false vacuum. By freeing energy, fields and particles were created. And this process created our universe as we know it now, with donuts and Zlatan. So, before going to bed tonight, take a minute and say... Thank you, Vacuum, for giving me Zlatan.